the 800 meters for the men to get on the way we have uh, with us uh, dr bharat remember yesterday we uh, had time spent with him <clears throat> looking at the 800 meters and the triple jump both on simultaneously uh, let's look at the 800 meters uh, what are the precautions that you need to take in the middle distance running because remember we talk of different medical issues in the 100 different medical issues i presume in the 200 the 400 and the 800 and so on and so forth 800 what according to you are the major issues well there is nothing specific about 800 but 800 uh, and all the middle distance running is a uh, when we look at the energy pathways that are involved, it is a combination of uh, sprint and also to some extent the endurance part of it. So the injury profile is also such that we will have a lot of uh, muscle tears but also a combination of uh, tendonitis type which are which are a part of uh, overuse injuries. So what we see here is overuse injuries and acute injuries both combined. We'll uh, <clears throat> continue to talk, detect the genes and then what kind of muscle fiber profile that you have so that you can ideally choose the event right from the word go when the athlete starts training very young. <clears throat> so we now set off here on uh, the first lap a reminder that uh, the athletes after the first bend would all get in the world record david uh, radisha 140.91 in the men set in 2012 records uh, doctor if you look at the world record 2012 the men's record also 2018 five years uh, and the meet record Gamanda Ram uh, 2005 so what to, according to you would be the reason as to why in the 800 and we're talking of the 800 because that's on at this point of time and they're going to the final 400 meters uh, why do have would do you think would not they wouldn't have been broken is, is it got anything to do with medical science Definitely. Now, one thing the athletes do a lot these days is abuse supplements. Now, supplements, you need to understand that they are made in the factory. So, they need to have some kind of shelf life. They come with a lot of preservatives, which in turn hamper the gut microbiome and then it affects their recovery. So, what in fact the athlete thinks is it is helping them while it is actually doing more harm than good. Altitude state. So, they, so, so it's, it's very simple science, is it? Yes, it is very simple science combined with genetics and then the right nutrition. Okay, so the most important aspect here is nutrition. Unless you give the body the raw ingredients. Okay, so genes only are 50%. Okay, so the environment which includes your sleep, stress, your training and your nutrition is the other half.